courage isn't a brilliant dash, a daring deed in a moment's flash. It isn't an instantaneous thing, born of despair with a sudden spring. It isn't a creature of flickered hope, or the final tug at some slipping rope. But it's something deep in the soul of man that is working always to serve some plan. Courage isn't the last resort in the work of life or the game of sport. It isn't a thing that a man can call at some future time when he's apt to fall. If he hasn't it now, he will have it not when the strain is great and the pace is hot. For who would strive for a distant goal must always have courage within his soul. Courage isn't a dazzling light that flashes and passes away from sight. It's a slow, unwavering, ingrained trait with the patience to work and the strength to wait. It's part of a man when his skies are blue. It's part of him when he has work to do. The brave man never is freed of it. He has it when there is no need of it. Courage was never designed for show. It isn't a thing that can come and go. It's written in victory and defeat and every trial a man may meet. It is part of his hours, his days and his years, back of his smiles and behind his tears. Courage is more than a daring deed. It is the breath of life and a strong man's creed. There will always be something to do, my boy. There will always be wrongs to right. There will always be need for a manly breed and men unafraid to fight. There will always be honor to guard, my boy. There will always be hills to climb and tasks to do and battles new from now till the end of time. There will always be dangers to face, my boy. There will always be goals to take and men shall be tired when the roads divide and proved by the choice they make. There will always be burdens to bear, my boy. There will always be need to pray. There will always be tears through the future years as loved ones are born away. There will always be God to serve, my boy, and always the flag above. They shall call to you until life is through for courage and strength and love. So these are the things I dream, my boy, and have dreamed since your life began. That whatever befalls when the old world calls, it shall find you a sturdy man. Failure is ceasing to try. It is accepting defeat and to all you may meet giving voice to a sigh. It is in thinking it vain to attempt furthermore, and in bowing to pain when the muscles grow sore. Failure is stepping aside from the burnt of the fray in a weak-hearted way, being content to abide in the shadows that fall, and in being afraid. Out of life, after all, nothing is left to be made. Failure is thinking despair, the forsaking of hope and the refusal to cope with the day's round of care. It is in heeding the cry, all is lost, and to stay with defeat and not try for the happier day.